for line number 11, we have contract labor. This is pretty common in the internet marketing world. A lot of people use outsourcing to get certain things done for them instead of having to actually have a real employee. When you have a real employee, there's all kinds of other complexities that revolve around that. You have taxes that you're going to have to pay on uh, their income, whereas if you're simply outsourcing, then these people are independent contractors, and they have to report uh, their own income and pay their own taxes on that instead. So obviously that is the more common way to go online because it is simply cheaper for uh, the people that are doing the outsourcing. So anything that you've paid for this, this could be hiring people to write articles for you. Later on it could be things like hiring people to do customer support for you or to develop products for you. It can even be um, really, really simple stuff or really complicated stuff. If you're just hiring people on Fiverr to make quick little graphics for you at five bucks a pop, all of that can still be deducted and all those little amounts can really add up sometimes. Now, here as well, if you are paying a particular person, then you have to report that when you have paid them more than $600 in a year. And this again is done with a Form 1099 MISC. Um, that's, a, that's a good question, uh, Rito. What about people who live outside the USA? Do we also have to file this particular form? Now, if you're living outside of the USA and you're the one that's paying people uh, to do the outsourcing, then this particular form would not apply to you, but there may be something in your own country similar to this form. But in the reverse situation, if you are a U.S. citizen and you are outsourcing or paying commissions even to people that live outside of the USA, then you do not have to file this form on those individuals simply because this only relates to U.S. taxes. Now, in a way, that's kind of a little bit of a loophole. Um, you don't ever have to worry about filing these forms if you are a U.S. citizen and you're only using affiliates or uh, outsourcing with people that live outside of the country. You never have to worry about filing these. Um, yes, but you can still deduct it. You still include that amount on uh, this line, line number 11, or on the previous line for the commissions, whichever applies. You still get to deduct it, but you don't have to report uh, the actual people that you have been paying that to. Because ultimately, the United States can't enforce those people to pay any kind of income tax on that money. That's what it's really about, is not necessarily to prove that you've paid those people, but the government wants to know who's getting paid so they can be sure to tax it. So if they are not U.S. citizens, then the government obviously simply doesn't worry about that because they can't tax those people.